hot list. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Pay Shiner, and I'm back with another vlogmas video. Ho, ho, ho. All right, y'all, we finna get straight into this freaking video, but before I do, make sure you like, like you like smacking on some good food, comment like you do when people be taking you out and taking you to new places, and subscribe because we family now, and you wanna join the lit crew. You feel me? Let's go. Today I'm doing something I have not done on my channel in a long time and baby yes we bring it back to page eats Yes, I'll be trying this new spot in Houston that is supposed to be like a food hall or a food I don't know. It's supposed to be like a food place. It's supposed to have like 20 different food places to eat in there I'm about to go check it up. Go check it out check it up check it out check it up check it out i'm gonna have to go check it out and see what's up with this food place see if the food is slapping there give y'all my true opinion y'all already know when it's coming from me it ain't gonna be no lies okay i'm telling the truth nothing but the truth so help me god okay i will be telling y'all everything from how much it costs to park how much it costs to get in this that then the third what's the vibes in the environment like so stay tuned if you want to know if this was gonna be on your houston hot list next okay let's go all right so we are currently traveling from the galleria area and it is going to take us about 15 minutes to get there so 15 from the galleria and i mean the galleria is pretty much kind of in the middle ish of everything so you could probably estimate guesstimate from there but that's how long it's going to take us on this drive and that is at midday no traffic so It was good too. I don't know if I'm gonna eat a whole meal from there, but it was like the taste. The dude was really nice. Who are these fans, baby? I need to work out some more. In a new Louis Vives, girl, one with his green silicon and real bless. Can I do a breeze for the head of the penis? Coolest breeze that me rocking a sleeveless. Hey! This place is so cool and so peaceful. It is so much more than just food. The environment is so nice. It's called Skyline. And I think it has a whole bunch of lights that light, light up at night, but mostly we're out in the garden right now and we're about to go back in to decide what we're gonna eat.
chilling on the bean bags. A 10 out of 10 that the place was very cool there is they're not even done building it is relatively new so i think there's supposed to be some new stuff that they're adding but uh they had everything from bean bags where you could just chill a whole sky lounge with a garden that is getting built into uh, every food place you can think of okay so i got hibiscus tea from um this nigerian I food place I got hibiscus tea from a Nigerian food place. It was really, really good. I, I love hibiscus tea. So if you can hit me with a good one any day of the week, and I'll be like, oh, this is so good. And baby, they was handing out, um, they was handing out, what's it called? It's like tasters, like it's um candy. They was hanging out a little trays. They was like, try this, try that, try this, try that, try that. Because they trying to get the food out there, get it known. But we ended up eating from, uh, what was the place called? Lee Jane's. Lee Jane's, you know. I ended up eating from Lee Jane's. I say I did not enjoy the mac and, mac and cheese, but he I said, loved it. "Yeah, as you can hear, he he loved the mac and cheese." I was already like, "It's not, it's not mac and cheese." It's not mac and cheese. It's Alfredo noodles, if you ask me. And I was already a little worried because I was like, "Why my Alfredo noodles coming with some Ritz cook, uh, like Ritz crackers on the top?" I was, I was like worried. Ritz? Like I like the Ritz. The I like, like the Ritz. Ritz. It was so from him. It was a ten out of ten. From me, it was like a three out of ten. But I don't like Alfredo sauce, so take that into account. My judging, it was cool, but it wasn't like slapping. You know, it wasn't slapping, but it was definitely good. It's another opinion all right so then we had the chicken i had the chicken them little chicken wings was pretty big it came with six but the chicken wings was big like i didn't even eat all my six i like spicy food and if you're a spicy person i went with spicy because i didn't know how hot clucking hot was but if you're a spicy person and you like spicy food like i do go with clucking hot because spicy was not spicy i was like this ain't spicy. What a spicy. But it was good, though. The seasoning was good. The chicken was cooked real good. It was juicy, but it was crispy. It was 10 out of 10. They got this garlic sauce. It's at 75 cents more, but it's worth it. Make sure you get this garlic sauce because that garlic sauce was banging. Made the chicken more banging than it already was. He had the um, plain Jane sandwich. The plain Jane. I had a piece of his chicken it's strip spicy. that came out of that. He said it was spicy. Oh, he had the plain Jane spicy. Excuse me. Uh, he had the plain Jane spicy. He said it was good. He enjoyed it. I ate one of his chicken tenders out of there, and that chicken tender was banging. So if it was anything compared to the whole sandwich, then it was definitely a 10 out of 10 for me. And after that, we had some french fries. Now, if you're getting... This is the only thing, though. Okay, so my chicken did not come with fries. We had to order fries on the side. Uh, the mac and cheese is on the side too. The sides are three fifty each, no matter what side you get. But his sandwich, the plain Jane, came with fries. So if that gives you an idea of like what you want to order, what's going on. But the fries are banging. I can tell you that those were some good fries. I was I was smacking on them fries the entire time. They was good. They were long. They were thick. You know, I like me some good ratio fries. So I'm telling y'all the whole nine yards. Now we got refills, and as y'all can see, it was just a uh, it was just a machine for drinks. So it seems like no matter where you order your drink from, any entire place, the refills are free. So that's a bun that's always a bonus with me. Um, and then they had a couple of drinking stations. We didn't get a drink, but everybody was at the bar like it was crazy. So clearly the drinks was good, but definitely would go again. Definitely would say Lane Jane's or Lee Jane's or Le Le Jane? Lee Jane's. I would eat them again. So, yeah, y'all, I would say this is one of the best page eats I've had thus far. 
because it was so much it was so much more than a page youtube video it was so much to explore so much to eat so much to see so yeah if you made it this far guess what you made it to the end of this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and make sure you hit that bell so when i post our video uh you can tell make sure you hit that bell jingle bells make sure you hit that bell 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 make sure you hit that bell jingle bells make sure you hit that bell 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 all right y'all it's Hey, Turner, let's go. Take it, take it.